morning and happy Monday. Just got done working out. Always nice to knock out the workout first thing in the morning. Just worked on some conventional deadlifts. Usually pull sumo. Do people still give shit for pulling sumo? And then I did a bunch of back accessories and then in between sets, I've been prepping for the uh, market open here. You probably already know what the schedule is. Same shit, different toilet, but time to try to make some money. All right, so just got done trading and I thought today was gonna be a red day because the day didn't start out too well. The first thing I went after was Ovid, which was like a 60 something percent gap. And I tried it both long and short and didn't work both ways and ended up losing like over an R on it. So I thought the rest of the day was gonna be pretty slow. But then the penny stocks came in clutch today, like the EOSE and the VXRT. And then I did replay the Ovid later in the afternoon and made my money back. So ending the day up six and a half R's, which is pretty nice. I'll take it. And I don't know if you've noticed, but my setup may look a little bit different here. I did downsize a bit. So I wanted to rearrange my office so that it's more functional for my YouTube and then also for my trading. I meant to do it over the weekend, but because it was Father's Day weekend, I didn't have the time. So I have to get it done today. <music> Okay, so just quickly rearrange the office. The initial uh, plan is to use this for my trading desk, this one for my editing and to film. I'm only using one of these monitors for my editing. This one I no longer need. So this is just kind of sitting here. I don't know if I should sell it or like give it away. But yeah, I think that's gonna do it for now. I just have it set up so that I'm able to trade for tomorrow. I know it's super messy, but I'll deal with it later. This was a lie. It was not dealt with later. All right, I think I need a car wash because I've got spider webs growing on my Porsche because I barely drive this car and it is filthy. And do you know what I realized? I do not deserve a Porsche. <laughs> I do not deserve nice cars because I am not a car guy and I'm just not gonna take care of them. All right, so it's actually 7.30 in the evening now. Today, Tyson had his first day of school. So me and Janet decided to go pick him up and then he got hungry, so we decided to go eat some Korean barbecue. And then after we got home from that, I was super tired and in a long time, or for the first time in a long time, I ended up taking a nap. We got the munchies again, so Tyson got a happy meal. I got a Big Mac and then watching the Celtics. Looks like they're gonna win the championship. As a Lakers fan, I always hate seeing Boston win. They completely dominated the Mavs this series. But yeah, I'm just gonna eat this and then um, call it a night. All right, another day of trading in the books. Didn't do a whole lot today. Stuck with the low price stocks again, just scalping some of the penny stocks. There wasn't much to look at, I thought, from the gap list that we had. And tomorrow's a holiday, so it's Juneteenth, so the market is closed. So me and Janet decided to surprise Tyson and pick him up from school today, and then we're gonna drive down to SD and take him to Legoland tomorrow. All right, we just picked up Tyson. Tyson, were you surprised that you got out early? Yeah. Do you know where we're going? Where? Somewhere fun. Target! Target. <laughs> time a lot of good family time and actually i got a long day of work ahead getting my pre-workout in squat rack is the first thing on the menu and yeah time to get to work i am currently sitting on the toilet and when i noticed this guy 
everything just flowed right out of me. <laughs> Holy shit. I don't know how I'm gonna get out. Thought today's workout was gonna suck because of all the driving and walking around Legoland all day. I felt pretty stiff this morning, but surprisingly, once I got under the bar, moved pretty good. Maybe it's all the good food I've been eating. All right, we're about five minutes away from the open. There are a couple of watches like the Hewitt Packard and Kroger looking higher, and then probably gonna keep an eye on the penny stocks because that seems to be doing well this week. A few moments later. All right, so it's about seven and a half hours later. Market is closed. So at the open, market ended up selling off. So HPE, uh, Kroger, they all ended up selling off. So nothing set up for me. The Nikola, however, was gapping down over 10% today. So I was watching that as a penny stock. Did it as a breakdown at the open and then also caught a breakdown in the afternoon. So ending the day up about 35 or 3400 i believe so not a bad day at all but the day is not finished yet today is actually the last day of the may mentorship so that's still going on and today's the last coaching session and we got a big discussion on trading psychology it's gonna probably take about a couple of hours so gotta handle that there's nothing that's gonna be risk free the only thing you can do is control that risk and that is a wrap on mentorship number two. Shout out to all the mentees. You guys were awesome. Great job. And we decided to do another one at the end of this year. I probably already announced it by the time this video comes out. Uh, if you signed up already, it's going to be an amazing experience. Can't wait to meet you and see you then. Yeah. Tyson, show him your backpack. So Tyson got a new backpack. And Spider-Man. Yeah, and you wanted to get Spider-Man. Um, hanging off of it. And then I promised him to make the Lego. Uh, Janet already made the yellow one. I promised to make the G-Wagon. And then this is how it turned like the leather one. Oh yeah, and that's how the yellow one turned out. Janet did a good job. Now it's my turn. Alright, there we go. That's pretty sick. Yeah, it's pretty sick. You like it, Tyson? Yep. Yeah. Even the roof open. Yeah. Very gentle. You keep it. It's very scratchy, guys. So don't break it until I tell you you can touch it. Okay. All right. So this week we're kind of going off schedule. Usually I'm cooking throughout the weekday, but because of the holiday, haven't I found the time to grocery shop or anything like that? Tyson wanted Panda Express. So we got some grilled chicken, Beijing beef. Wanted to try the hot orange chicken it's like a new thing string beans greens rice and then chow mein I'm trying to keep it somewhat healthy no noodles for me i also cooked three whole eggs and there's my dinner all right fortune took the time your clever mind will lead you to many rewards Happy Friday. I woke up a little bit late today. I usually wait for like 3, 3.30, but today I woke up around 4, just because I knew I wasn't going to bench today. I tooth my shoulder. It's always the same shoulder. Use that extra time to get a little extra sleep. All right, last day of the trading week. I think it's been a pretty decent week so far, so let's try to finish strong. All right, market is closed. Ending in the day up a little over three hours, but the day definitely didn't start that way because the first trade I took was the ONON and I missed my exit when it got to targets. And then I ended up taking a full loss on it. So really bad management there. And then I went after the NKLA again. Yesterday did well as a short, today got bought and did well as a long. And then at the end of the day, I caught some of the CRSP as that was going climactic to the downside just for a quick bounce. I only did it with half size and then it filled me uh, partial shares. Yeah, I think uh, today should have been better if I got out on the ONON when it got to target, but not a bad week at all, given that we had Wednesday off, but ending the week, little shy of 10k but the day isn't over yet first i'm gonna hit up uh the shower and then i have to work on editing a youtube video <music> office was getting too hot so moving into the main house <music> all right so it is a little past 10 now and i've been editing for the last 
what is that, like eight hours. So it's been like a 16 hour work day. And the reason why I'm grinding this out is because tomorrow is my mom's birthday. So got a lot done. The video should be out tomorrow, tomorrow Saturday. So yeah, Saturday sometime in the morning. Yeah, I'm gonna get some shut eye because uh, I am tired. <laughs> All right, we're at Laurie's. This is one of the OG spots here in LA for prime rib. I got the beef bowl. These definitely got smaller. I think inflation is uh, hitting them pretty hard here. Now you get locked up. You're on this side. Put them all, yeah. <laughs> Wait for the clam. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Woo! Oh, it is. Come next to the Come Finally found some time to get a haircut, much needed haircut, but I'm with the little homie. We're here at City Walk. I think we're gonna end the week with a flick. We're gonna watch uh, Inside Out 2. Heard it was pretty good. And then, yeah, that's gonna be the week. Thanks for hanging with us. As always, I appreciate you for being here and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye. Hey, some Legoland. Still the door.